That's why we remember. You imagine, no, I am explaining about my experience in 84 and I am still remembering them. Why I am remembering? It's because they are marvelous. Correct? So right. Nothing wrong with that. That's why you have seen. I used I asked you once, right? Yes. Yeah? It was only a message, a question. What did I ask you? Write it out. What do you want? Or you will read it out, right? I have not seen people. You, are, you, are, you don't have to repeat. Only once you have to turn. That has to be there. You will repeat. Crisp. Clear. Clear. Crisp. Clear. 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 It has to send a message. No two time repetition in the classroom also. What will happen now? There is a tendency in students if I am going to repeat twice, first time they are not present to <laughs> Because anyway he is going to tell next time. Yes, yes, yes. It's true, it's true. It's true. It's true. It's true. Why are you wasting time? <laughs> and what will happen to the most interesting fellow? He will listen boring. to you. Same fellow you are repeating two times. It's boring class. Yes. So you cannot be a good student in a bad teacher. That's why people rate teachers as bad. <laughs> a bright student will rate you as bad. Anyway, bad student will rate you as bad. Correct <laughs> <laughs> right now? Yes. So never repeat in the class. Only once. What I said is set. Instruction has to be done like this. And then just follow. But the, tender, the, the, the habit is not the property. They do what they want. They don't listen to instructions. They never heard instructions. They don't know how to give instructions. So once you say, I have told in the morning what is to be done, then see something else is being done. So they don't have a habit of listening to instructions. You have to be very, very crisp, clear, yes, sharp, yes. Sharp, strong. sharp, strong. strong. Even to a dog, don't say, Kutta, <laughs> Betty will do. Get out. <laughs> go. Get out. Go. <laughs> 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 it's been yesterday, right? Yes, sir. Study class. Did they repeat anyone? No. You yeah, just see my recording? No. Hmm? No repetition. Yes. Do you have to repeat it? No. Only it goes yeah. into the class. That's why he, he, when you make a presentation or an uh, e-learning, will you repeat all the sentences? Yeah. If somebody is recording for a telecast, will you repeat it two times? No. Yeah. Is it not? So a class of yours has to be like a recording standard. And not very speedy. I am not speaking in uh, 150 words per hour. <laughs> Speak only 50 words per word. See, I, I can speak 150 words per minute to show that I, I am a good speaker. <laughs> Is it not? I have done it also. I will show you some of the recordings. <laughs> the 20 minutes was my presentation time given for a conference. A lot of people started cramping the program and I was told 7 minutes. So what is fine. I'll show you how to do this in seven minutes. <laughs> Twenty minutes, seven minutes. Me karanga. <laughs> the chairman did not understand it. He said, "Rewind it. It's already recorded. Rewind it. Reduce the speed, and he hear that he will understand." It. <laughs> <laughs> it was science communication. <laughs> the program was on science communication. <laughs> Scientific communication, ultimately. Even <laughs> sir. They were having eight units of syllabus, but no time. I don't know why stupid teachers, when they talk about the completing syllabus, I want to hammer them. <laughs> See, <laughs> syllabus completion is a teacher's stupid uh, agenda. The agenda is how your students are learning. You want to read it and then finish it off. I have, I have read the finishing my all syllabus. Where is the benefit for children? Yeah? You teach them, make them to learn. 
Do you want to finish the syllabus in two days? No, I don't mean that. I can finish it. I can finish this. That's not the aim. The aim is to make them learn. Don't create average students in this world. Create at least 10 bright students. Understood. Give them knowledge. Completing syllabus is never an agenda. It is a university agenda and college agenda. Teachers need not be part of it. I am not saying that you should not complete the syllabus. You should complete the syllabus. At least, if the class is to be over by October, finish it by August. Give knowledge. Empower them. Equip them. Understood? That's more important. We are completing syllabus and producing a lot of people. No sir, I don't mean that, but... Uh, what is the use? Hmm? Syllabus completion should not be the aim of any teacher. What is the point in doing it? We have an internal exam on second. First you are putting class to complete the syllabus. <laughs> Unacceptable. That's why students are not coming. Yesterday also principal was asking. How many students? He keeps asking, you know. What is the attendance? Set 30, 25. I asked the army. 25 or 30, right? He asked me why with your uh, with your intervention also it is not improving. I said, what can be done? I cannot do anything. No do anything. They should feel, yes, I am coming to the class because I am getting some knowledge. Right? So attendance is not compulsory. Class is not compulsory. I don't. I, I will ask people. You want to come and come and sit. If you want to go, go. That's it. You are more worried about administrative aspect than teaching. What is important? Teaching. Teaching is not important. From Learning is important. Learning. You are finishing. It. That's why classroom should not be a teaching room. It has to be interactive. Learning room. I am not teaching, they are learning from you. You understood? Teacher is only incidental, he is not important whether you or me, makes no difference. What is important is we have first semester, second semester, bit first year, second year students. They have to learn. How do they learn? One input is from you. More than that, 60% input they should find from different places. So you must make them to read textbook. 